He was definitely seated third. Yeah. All right, so we're immediately starting on uh, Pokemon Stadium 2. We got the Alomar. Now, real question is, is like, are they prepared for like just these character matchups? Like, these character matchups are weird. You didn't have too long to train for these matchups. So being put up against Inkling or being put yeah. up against Olimar is just really interesting. Yeah. Especially on Zero Zen's part, since he definitely didn't play for majority of uh, Smash 4's life. So truly understand what Olimar can do. It's like, it's kind of the same in Brawl, just with definitely some uh, noticeable differences, especially yeah, since he has tilts and such. It. He's got some weird, even even if you play Smash 4 in this game, he's got some really weird frame data, specifically on his Smash attacks that oh, yeah. you have to get used to. Oh, just rolling with the yellow Pikmin. Oh, this down smash just rolls right past him. Crow is so good at finding those smash attacks. Oh, no. The <laughs> <laughs> rolled over the Pikmin. And that was a great option out of zeros, and he immediately rolled away. Knew that uh, Crow was looking for a grab after that follow-up. All right, go ahead and punish him with a jab, down throw. Oh, my goodness, still... Still trying to keep this going. Still keeping it going. Ain't no trying. And the Ooh, dare. Ooh, it didn't get the spike, but it's still, no, no, it didn't kill him. But that almost was a very. Oh, so okay. Now he's up three <laughs> stocks to uh, one. Crow, Crow is, is on fire right now. Exactly. Okay, there's going to be F smash. All right. It's still like he's just doing his thing. This is basic crow oh play just God. just mixing you up with his just running away running back in just bobbing and weaving yeah and that's normally what zeros in tries to do but just add some short hops in there and but works right works right for it he's starting to get these follows but then there's combo stopping that being combo breaker excuse me get four there no oh my goodness up what? smash that was such a that was dominant a game one. fast game wow oh my god Since he's getting rid of Battlefield right there, he's definitely getting, he's trying to get rid of those platforms that allow Zero Zen to camp him out if he were to get the lead. So that leaves Final Destination, uh, back to Pokemon Stadium. Yep. Is that, did you see, are they going back to Pokemon Stadium? Yep. Okay. So Zero Zen does not think the stage was, was the problem. At the same time, I mean, if you get rid of Battlefield, it's like that's just not going to, you're not going to be able to camp him out really. Yeah. Which is what he was definitely looking for. He's he like, I'm. It's definitely frustrating for him to try and catch Crow. Yeah. This gonna be an up throw, up air. Not getting it. Not getting it on him. Oh. Jeez. All right. And this is where this is where he needs to shine. Where yep. Zero Zen's pressure is very solid. Now he has to make it so that Crow just stays in that corner, but overstands just a bit and, and ends up trading spots with him. Yeah. Still trying to fight back. There's the uh, rapid jab. The back air. Tries to go to straight to him. Ooh. I love the fire effect on the red Pikmin now. It's so nice. Like, yeah. all these, just the subtle details, I swear. Yeah. This game looks beautiful. Oh, yeah. So, percent, definitely in the favor of Crow. But Zero's in. His pressure has been much better in this match. He has him off stage right now. There's going to be the bomb. Oh, the bomb. That was literal perfect. And wow. there you go. What a great back air by Zero's in. I hate to be the commentator that says great back air, but hey, it truly it really was. was. <laughs> and he, he actually like just all the pressure right there, as we mentioned, as I mentioned before. And there's the F smash. So now it's even the game back up. Two socks apiece. Both of them still fairly low percent. Like yeah, like he has to shut him down. He cannot let Olimar do whatever he wants. And that trade definitely working out in Crow's favor. Yeah. Keep having to stop myself from saying work, but <laughs> I, I might as well just do it at this point. Yeah. All right. The jabs into the back throw. Get stage control. Now he gave up stage control. Zero's in needs to hold. He should have just waited for an option from work. God Down tilt to, to beat the roller. I am so surprised that that didn't at least trade. It just beat it outright. There's down tilt up air, and he air dodges onto the stage. Back air. Oh, well, I, I, it took me a second to realize that uh, Crow actually hit him with a back air. I thought I saw Zero's ends come out, and it just didn't matter. <laughs> Man. Yeah. <laughs> the paint just exploded in his face because the Pikmin was already there. All right, he pulled out. He pulled out the purple. I guess two reds. Two reds Ooh. and a purple. There's gonna be a punish. Just basic forward air. Rolled right over the purple, so it's gone. 
Man, just all this pressure from Crow. This pressure in these traps that he's got going for him. Zirzin just doesn't, he's not sure how to get past this wall of Pikmin. Uh, yeah, I, I, there's something in this matchup that Crow has got some, a clear advantage. Um, be it character matchup, player matchup, or a combination of the two. Oh my goodness, up throw not going to be able to do it. If that was the blue, it would have been a solid maybe. <laughs> a solid. Nice recovery by Crow, kind of like a middle. He didn't go low, but he didn't go as high as he was expected either. He was trying to get him with the offstage kills, which is the what he seems to be best at. But All right, another forward air coming out from Zero Zen. He's still sitting on the second stock. There's the back air. Oh, so that's my two, goodness. Two two stocks in a row from Crow, who is in in the zone. <laughs> he is in a zone that I've I I've never seen him in. Oh man. Really, really killing it. So zeros in, maybe not so sure about uh, just going back to the same stage again since he was two stocked there twice. And I doubt he'll do a, a no. character change. <laughs> no, I go back to your roots. Go other. back to your roots. Play Mario. Go Mario, yeah. Uh, he went town and city. He's staying in Inkling, but this time on town and city. All right, loser of this gets third. And Crow is up 2 0 right now. This is. Just phenomenal. He's he's like the Olimar and DK, man. Yeah, he's Just a solid combination right there, to be honest, at it, least on him. It really seems to, uh, to to be able to scare just about anybody you play. He's got he's got something that's going to be hard to beat. And it's literally the same two, main two characters he played in Smash 4. Yeah. So for the most part, his fundamentals for those characters transferred over. Olimar still stayed the same. So. Yeah, he kind of won <laughs> the, the character lottery with Ultimate. All right, Joe throws away all Pinkman, uses that up B to push him away. He's going to go all the way all to the other the side. Way. What can you do? <laughs> and Zero Zen was doing a phenomenal job of just pressuring him, but he was able to just get out of jail free card for that one situation. But that's going to be an F smash. Yep. You're done. All right, so Zero Zen, take the first, Zero Zen takes the first stock for the first time in this set. Um, possibly starting to adapt and figure out how to do this or how it is they're supposed to get the hits and kills on this Alomar. Landing a few rollers, which he wasn't really able to do before. He stuffs out his own, uh, stuffs out uh, Crow's back air. Yeah, he's starting to box a little bit more. Uh, spacing's definitely looking really good, but it's mainly that pressure. That's why he's able to build up that percent. That's why he was able to get it going. Whew. But work immediately cutting that momentum. Taking that stock. There's a roller again. Yeah, he ends up trading, but it's a trade in Zero Zen's favor. Oof. Oh, man. Another one. F smash. There it is. Yeah. What just happened, man? <laughs> Zero Zen turned up. Yeah. He, he's just really moved around really well to the point where it's, it's almost hard to tell. What, when is he dashing and when is he rolling? And I don't mean rolling like <laughs> like shield roll. I mean using his IB. So suddenly you're just buried. He's smothering you and now you're underground. All right, this is shades of his set versus Shad earlier. Yeah. But, ooh, all right. Crow keeping it even. Crow definitely keeping it even. Only taking 26%. That's not hateful. <laughs> Here comes the bomb. Didn't manage to connect. Oh, man. He's mm, Crow's <laughs> He's ready to end this. He's about to, he's about to, if he wins this game, then he will have 3-0, Dark Shad, and Zeros in a row. And those are two solid and that's players. That's amazing. Yeah. That is something. Oh, God. <laughs> Wish I could say that. <laughs> no kidding. All right. Now he's slowing. Now momentum's definitely slowed down. Crow's being a bit more patient. He knows if he gets hit by that, there that's it. it. All right. So zeros in the mountain to come back. Definitely. Mm. All right. So yeah, two one zeros in, trying to get this comeback going. Put himself on the board, and he's definitely made the adjustments. This is now forced Crow to do make adjustments of his own. Definitely still going to stick with that Olimar. Yep. Uh, what is he doing? He's thirsty. Or low on energy, either way. Ooh. He's got a Nas to solve his problem. I thought he was about to chug the whole thing. <laughs> he's about to crush he's that He's about to Nas. pull up. Um, yeah. Who's that? Who that Street Fighter player? Was that? Uh, 
Punko? I have no idea. Where you just chugged a Red Bull and just <laughs> <laughs> went to beat. I think it was Daigo. Yeah, you beat Daigo. Did you win? Evo. Yeah, at Evo. Uh, he just chugged a Red Bull, took his shirt off, <laughs> and the next beat Daigo. 2-0. Oh, my gosh. All right, so now we're in the Yoshi story. Or Yoshi, yeah. Yoshi's Island. Yoshi Island. Yep. God dang it, too many Yoshis. Um. No kidding. <laughs> yeah, there's Yoshi's Island, Yoshi Story, and then another Yoshi's Island. Yeah. <laughs> and then there's Happy Tree. Yeah. yeah. All right, just throwing all the pick Pikmin at him, getting that damage going. All right, so Crow looks like he's back to his, uh, what we saw from him in the first couple games is in terms of this big lead he's created for himself in the beginning. All right, couple but Zero's in his got advantage, and he's got him off stage. Oh, trading positions right there. There's going to be yeah. a dash attack catching him, jump from the ledge. There's this roller again. Instead of shielding it, oh he just ate gosh. the hit. And he charged it, too, for a good amount of time. Yeah, now that lead's gone. What that, lead? That got him a kill from the middle of the stage at, like, 70%. Oh, the oh, down air trade. Interesting trait. interaction. <laughs> this guy here to help. All right, down air, still hanging on to the stock at 152 exactly for once. No no decimals. <laughs> <laughs> There's going to be this roll of just steamrolling all the way. Like, that was a good three-fourths of the stage. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> near into down smash. Ooh. There's going to be a punish up air. All right. Only taking 48% in the process. Gonna be able to build that back, no problem. With two down tilts into an oh. F smash. What was that damage? He was at 14 when he before getting hit by the F smash. Yeah. And now wow, he's he is all over he him. He's cooking it. Oh up. my gosh! This <laughs> little platform shows up every time. Again. <laughs> oh! And wow, F kills. smash! Oh my goodness! All right, girls looking to be in grand finals. Yeah, he probably stopped denying in that situation. Probably expected not to kill him. That was 25% on the F smash. Oh, wow. my God. <laughs> it's powerful. Jeez. For a little guy, too. Yeah. I mean, it's less him doing the work, more so the Pikmin. The Pikmin. I don't know which Pikmin it was. I don't know if they all do different damage or what, but that's a lot, regardless of which one. All right. And Man. with all this momentum, it's looking like Crow's going to take this. Going to go for the dare. Got hit by the uh, splash damage from the from the Inkling's recovery. Literal splash damage. All right, there's gonna be F smash. Okay. <laughs> All right. Zero. Pull on in. Ink. Zero's in. Has got to dig deep. Definitely got to dig deep. He's done. He's done. He's been in harder situations. He can definitely yeah. do this. Oh, oh, he's a oh my and it kills. God! Crows in grand finals. What a warrior. <sighs> Jesus H. And now it will be Battle of the Forward Smashes. <laughs> Man, as soon as it's over, I have to leave immediately. <laughs> How long of a drive for, for you guys? It's five and a half hours, and I'm supposed to be to work at 1 a.m. So what the heck do you do? Uh, I work at a group home. Okay. Yeah, and you got to have people there all the time. you know. That's fair. Oof. Or it's four. Did I say five? And a half? I'm at four and a half. It's four and a half. Okay. Yeah. Jeez. Still a long drive. It's a long drive. Yeah. I don't mind the drive. I just don't want to. Uh, people are staying late for me already. I'm no. I'm normally work at eleven after 